Duke Energy about a new smart metering system. Those systems allow for usage to be collected wirelessly. Homeowners can track their usage down by the hour, although some homeowners are still choosing to opt out. News 18's Marvin Bills joins us live with more on why one homeowner is choosing to stick to their meter reader. Marvin. This homeowner made sure to call Duke Energy immediately to say no to the new smart metering systems. He doesn't think the systems are necessary. Homeowners in Greater Lafayette are starting to notice a new addition to their homes. We call them AMI meters, which stands for Advanced Metering Infrastructure. These meters have already been installed in most homes, allowing electricity usage to be sent wirelessly and giving homeowners more control on how they use. But some homeowners like Zeb Christopher would rather not have these systems at all. I think the primary benefit is for the utility company. Zeb was out of town when he came home to a note from Duke Energy that these new systems would be installed. He doesn't believe these systems will benefit the homeowner. I don't think there's really any consumer demand for it. I think that's just what the utility companies want us to think. He believes it's something else. The wireless signal can go quite far. I've heard up to two miles, and um, we've already got radiation from our cell phones. The communication consultant for Duke Energy, Angelin Prodiger, begs to differ. That's not correct. Prodiger says there are other things to look forward to with these new systems. Significantly reduce the need for estimated bills. Uh, I mean, we have found through the years that uh, understandably customers want to be billed for their actual usage, not an estimate. Homeowners have the chance to opt out of the new systems, but will have to pay a fee. One time $75 fee, but then after that, an additional $17.50 on their bill per month. Now, if you are wondering why you'd be charged $75 with an added $17.50 a month fee, that is to pay for the meter reader to come out to your property and read your energy usage manually. Now, you can find more information on how to opt out of these smart metering systems or how to have it uninstalled from your home. Link to this story on WLFI.com. You'll also find more information about these smart meters and how they work. Reporting live in West Lafayette, Marvin Bills. News 18. Marvin, thank you. A marijuana is legal in